first of all, Cruz, congratulations, Captain of Leeds Rhinos. Uh, how does it feel? Yeah, it's um, it's unbelievable. It took me by surprise, to be honest. Um, really proud, really proud. Uh, I think I'm ready. Uh, it's something that I've got so much passion for the club and um, for the supporters. It's something that I, I, I really honour doing. Um, I could have I could have thought of three, four other people to do this, so that's probably what makes it really special as well. Um, but yeah, it's massive team effort, and it, I'm really looking forward to doing something special with this group that we've got. And does it make it even more special? Obviously, this has come part of it. There's been a process with the players as well, where they've they've picked their, their choices, and it's that's informed the, the coaching staff decisions. And the fact that your own teammates, your peers, have uh, acknowledged what you do for the side. Yeah, I think um, you know in professional sport, that's probably the biggest accolade that you can get that your peers um, think that you're fit to do the job. And um, yeah, like I said, it's, it, it, there will be a leadership group, and it's about everyone mucking in. Obviously, I've, I'll have the C next to my name, but it's not, you know, it's with Gary, um, Rich, Longe, uh, Zane, Priz, who went before me, uh, all all big leaders and all a massive part of what we're trying to do at this club and the history that we're trying to create. Um, I think we've got the team to do it. We, you know, we're young, uh, we're hungry, we um, we want to do really good things. I think if we train really hard and, and put a lot of emphasis on our standards and as behaviour, I think we'll, we, we will manage to do something really special. Um, but yeah, like I said, it's a massive collective uh, thing, even though I've got the C next to my name, it's, it's a massive collective group and um, we'll be looking forward to, to the season coming up. Do you think it will lead to any changes in your game, the fact that you are captain? No, um, I, I mentioned it to the lads up there. I'm going to, you know, there's obviously something that I'm doing that's got me in this position um, and I'm just going to continue to, to be me. Um, continue to train really hard and care. I, I care a lot about the club and about the lads and I think that's shone through and I think that's the, the reason why I've got the captaincy. Um, I care about my own performance. I, um, I, I'm really proud to, to wear the lead Rhinos badge. You know, I, I, I think sometimes in rugby league you're lost a little bit and you, you, you forget what big opportunities you get through rugby league and it's a massive massive opportunity my mum's really proud um, you know the lads at Mella that I, tra I travel with really proud of me and I'm really proud of myself uh, yeah it won't, it won't alter me at all it's just it's given me a massive smile um, I'm, I'm really happy and for the supporters as well I'm just going to do my job I'm going to go out there and do my job and do what ultimately has got me in this position in the first place and there's a wall at Headingley just as you're about to go onto the field that shows all the previous captains of the club lifting silverware, how much would you dream to, to add yourself to that montage? Yeah, um, I think it's more about the process. It'll be fantastic. It will be fantastic. Um, and I think, like I say, we have got the team to do it. But it's more about the process and how we get there and sustaining that high level of... Um, that's what the captains before me have, have, been, have been managed to do. They've, they've not come and won one and left and, you know, they've come and sustained a really high commitment to the, to, to the fans and to the players, to the coaching staff. And I think that's what's going to be big um, for me is not to just come and, you know, be, be a one-it wonder kind of thing. You, you want to you wanna etch yourself in history and, and be able to be recognised uh, for a long period of time of... of keeping high, really high standards. Um, so that's what I'm going to try to do and trust the process a little bit. I'm not too looking forward um, too much to what silverware I'm going to lift. It's not about that. I'm just going to take each day as it comes, each each game, and just, just try and be the best person I can. And you mentioned leadership there and experience, and one man who, who epitomised that is Tom Briscoe. It's his testimonial game on Sunday. Uh, how much of a help has he been to you in your time at the club, and, and how much does he deserve this testimonial? Yeah, I think... Um, before I mentioned what he's done for me, what he's done for rugby league in general, you know, record holder at um, Wembley and stuff like that. Um, the fans love him, you know, he, he, he epitomises what we want at Leeds Rhinos. And to, to answer your question of what he's done for me, he's, he's been really, he's, he's been like a quiet mentor to me. I speak to him quite a lot. Um, I run ideas by him and sometimes when I'm second guessing myself and my decisions, I'll, I'll ask him. Uh, I've grown really close to Tom over the um, over the time that I've been at the club, and he's he's a player that if you watch, um, if there's any tussles or you know, he's really his first one in there, and you can see how protective he is of the players, uh, which is a massive thing for us. Um, I think to get a testimonial for what he's done for rugby league is fantastic and well deserved, um, and. Another thing, when we did do the votes that you were mentioning about the leaders, he was in my top five as a leader, and you know he doesn't. He, he, he speaks when he has to speak, and he's fantastic when he speaks, and people listen. That um, epitomises a leader. But the other thing is, 
he leads by example and on the pitch and he's just ultimate ultimate professional um, and yeah I, I really hope the fans get down and support him because of what he's done for the club the town uh, the, the club the city and um, for me as for me as a professional has been massive